Hey guys, I just wanted to show you um, this quick little problem uh, that I've recently found about. It's called pebbling the chessboard or some variation like that. Um, so go grab a chessboard, grab a whole bunch of pennies or beans or M&Ms or marshmallows, doesn't really matter. Um, but here's basically how it works. There's going to be a set configuration. Uh, let's just say in the bottom left here, you've got three pennies. And uh, how you do it is you choose one, and as long as it has to the right and above clear, you put two new pennies in and pull out the original. And uh, you know, so they kind of move down and out. And you can only do it if, if it's clear to the right and above it. So like right now, this one here is stuck, can't move. This one's stuck, can't move. But this new one and this new one here can move. Uh, and so on and so forth. So the object of the game, we did that one, uh, you know, that one's stuck, that one's stuck, that one could move, but the object of the, the game is to find, there's a defined prison. In, in this case it's these three squares right here. And you want to clear those completely of the pennies. Um, so you see, you can see in this case here, I've got one here that uh, that's still in the prison from the original three that I started with. Um, so this is basically how the game starts, and uh, you just try to clear out the prison using those simple rules of uh, new penny above, new penny to the right, remove the original. Uh, you can try different variations, like your prison of three squares. Um, you start off with with two or you know, just one, which I guess would be the same thing because as soon as you tapped it, it would uh, give you this configuration. Um, but you can you know, keep going and work it to get your guys out of the prison. There's a really interesting video that I found on YouTube that I will share with you um, as well, but it is absolutely worth your time to pull out a chessboard or some other grid and a whole bunch of, of uh, markers and then just start seeing if you can break free from that prison and uh, from what I understand it instead of just an 8x8 board you would actually have an infinitely uh, tall board and infinitely wide so you could you could do quite a bit um, but it's it's a lot of fun just to kind of figure it out with with uh, just the chess board I'm sure Dimitri and Bam are already aware of this this problem and, and have looked at it. Um, mostly, I think Sean and Matt will get a kick out of it, but uh, who knows? Maybe other people will too. All right, peace out.